Welcome back, everybody. So the Congress of South African Trade Unions, or COSATU, will host a May Day rally at the James Motlati Stadium in Orkney in the Northwest Province. Indeed, and COSATU says that this Workers' Day comes at a crucial time as the country heads to elections. And at today's rally, the trade union will pledge its support for the ANC. So covering the story for us, we have our reporter, St. Leng Lihihi. St. Leng, it's good to have you with us this morning. Briefly take us through the program for today and, and, and what's expected to happen. Morning, Leanne and our viewers. In fact, I just recently just got the program printed out. Uh, it appears that we're going to have a very active, active fill uh, program where we're going to see members of COSATU, Alliance partners from the SACP, from the highway as well, give some keynote addresses there. We expect that the most pivotal keynote address will be given by Soli Petwe. We expect MPs like uh, Toko Didiza to also make their way and address workers today. You understand that the timing of the uh, uh, May Day rally comes at a pivotal time when we're on the brink of elections and workers have said that they align themselves with strengthening workers' issues and ensuring that workers' issues are at the forefront of everything when it comes to elections. We understand that, you know, uh, what is pivotal for them right now as COSATU is aligning themselves directly behind the ANC. We understand that they believe that this is the party that will take workers' issues forward. They believe that in their alliance, with the ANC and the SACP, they will be able to actually work together to ensure that workers' issues are brought to light. You understand, we're here in a mining community. Uh, it comes, you know, uh, just last night we saw a very disturbing occurrence happen in Rustenburg where over a thousand workers were uh, stuck underground. We expect that, you know, the talking point will also rally around the safety of mine workers in these mining communities. Yeah, earlier I I had actually arranged to speak to the provincial secretary. If you can just uh, give us a second, he's just arrived to give us a, his, his time. Uh, Job Gliso, welcome and thank you very much for your time. Just explain to us, Ntate, what is the focus for us today? Thank you very much. Uh, workers are here today. Uh, as you know, we're celebrating International Day. Uh, the reason we are here is to defend the victory that workers have made. Uh, previously, we struggled for many other things that were not there before. Uh, your annual leave, sick leave, and that's why we are here today. It's a day of celebration. Now, talking about celebration, the celebration also comes in a sad note where workers' safety is also uh, at a talking point. Uh, explain to us as a union, what do you have to say about safety of workers following the incident that we saw last night with over a thousand workers trapped underground? Very sad and uh, we are sending condolences to those who will be pass or who have passed on. We have heard about uh, the incident at Harmony. Uh, we heard about 1,000 800 workers were trapped at uh, uh, one of the, the, the steel mine. Uh, it's one of the, the demands. Uh, as you see workers gathering here, we'll be marching from here. Uh, one of our demands, we're demanding uh, safety in a workplace, particularly in uh, the mining uh, industry. Uh, we will want uh, uh, our government to ensure that uh, there is safety for, for mining. We can't, to lose one worker, it's too much uh, for us as COSAT. Focusing on today, just a quick preview. What are we to expect from speakers and who will they be? We, the Deputy General Secretary of COSATU, Comrade Soli Peto, who will be leading uh, COSATU as the keynote speaker, will be having the second uh, Deputy General Secretary of SACP, Comrade Chris, uh, will be having uh, the NEC member of ANC, Matt or Kodidisa, and will be having uh, BDS, uh, those who will be here, uh, as you know, we pledge in Soli solidarity for Palestine. So they will be here also to address workers. But mainly workers are here to celebrate immediately after uh, the speakers, uh, workers will celebrate their day. Thank you very much for your time, Intertit Lizo. Thank you. Uh, we're still going to give you more of coverage from this area here. But for now, back to you guys in studio.
Uh, Seth Langley, thank you very much for the uh, update there from the Northwest.